Hi everyone, today's video is a quick one. The focus will be on one of the best value red wine regions in the entire world, yet it's a place that barely gets mentioned here on YouTube. The focus will be on Minervois. It's located down in the languedoc roussillon area in the southern part of France. In this video, I'll discuss a little bit about the region, what you can expect to find in your wine glass, and I'll also include a tasting of a benchmark example that gets good international distribution. The wine to be tasted in this video was purchased at Total Wine & More, but the producer has a broad range that's sold in many international markets. Check the video description below for additional suggestions to search out while you're wine shopping. <laughs> The wine to be tasted is the 2020 Gerard Bertrand Orion Minervois for $17.99. The wine is made from 70% Grenache and 30% Syrah. Over the last several years, Gerard has become the most visible champion for the wines from the south of France, owning 17 properties across the region. Minervois is located between Carcassonne and Narbonne. This is full-on Mediterranean climate. It's very warm there in the summertime, but it's an area that has some elevation versus the rest of the languedoc Roussillon, and that is a big deal in terms of wine production. The fruit tends to get very ripe, but it also retains a good level of acidity, and that acidity lends freshness and lift to the wines. Now this is very much red wine country. More than 90% of the wine produced there is red. Recent years, there's been a bit more of a focus on some rosé and white that have really been quite noteworthy. But red wine is the primary focus here with Syrah, Grenache, Morvedra, Carignan, and Senso being the primary grape varieties. But very good examples of Minervois can be found for under $20. In terms of appearance, this definitely has some good depth color. If I put my fingers down at the base of the bowl and look down into the glass, uh, I cannot see my fingers at the deepest part of the glass. There's a little bit of fade as you get out to the edge of the glass. Keep in mind this wine's a 2020, so it does have a few years bottle age to it, but overall the color on this is really excellent and it extends to the edge of the glass. The aroma, it has this ripe red raspberry character, a little bit spicy, savory, peppery. Uh, there's a little bit of a rustic note to it. There's a slightest whiff of alcoholic heat. And on the back label, I see this wine shows a 14% alcohol. That's really quite typical for wines from this region. But I love the way this smells. And there's a little bit of an exotic spice character. It reminds me a bit of Asian five spice really smells wonderful. On the palate, really nice. Uh, good weight, good intensity. There's presence in that front, mid, back palate. Good ripeness on the wine. There's nothing green. There's nothing lean about it at all. It has some, some really uh, nice weight that just carries right on through to the back palate. There's a bit of tannin here, but it's not aggressive tannin, but it's certainly there. I would think this wine could age for a couple of years with no problem whatsoever. And oftentimes with wines that are in that $20 range, sub $20 range, you can find a lot of very well-made, solid commercial wines. This ticks all of those boxes, but a little more elevated as well. There's something about this that has a little bit of that, that it factor to it. It's a little bit, uh, a little more expressive. There's more nuance to it. There's more going on in this glass. This is really a solid bottle of wine. Now, in terms of how I would rate this wine, I would definitely recommend it. Nudging into that, highly recommended. If you like wines that have density, weight, structure, wines that have a good amount of heft to them, this is definitely going to be uh, a good fit for you. If you're fans of the wines from the Southern Rhone, you're going to get some feel for, for what you're going to get with this Minervois but it is uniquely different. There's some character that really stands apart from what you'll find in the Southern Rhone. Really do like this wine, and I'm going to be enjoying this a little later tonight. 
If you've watched some of my previous videos, you may have noticed that I'm experimenting with a bit of a different look for this video. If you have any feedback, I'd love to hear from you. I'm a one-man show for the most part, and I'm trying to improve the look of my videos. Your input would definitely be appreciated. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please consider doing it now. If you're hearing this message, you've gone to the end of the video, so no stalling subscribe definitely hit the like button also hit the notification bell that way you'll be kept up to speed on all things happening here all of these things help to get my videos out to a broader audience for me i'm going to be drinking some minervois tonight i'm really liking this wine i hope you're drinking something interesting as well and please stop back again before too long cheers <music>